Welcome to MBS Solutions. I am Manjunath, working as an assistant professor in the Department of Business Administration, VVC, Mysuru. If you have not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon for more videos on managerial economics and management and organizational behavior. In this video, let us discuss what is perception and what is the process of perception. So first let us understand the meaning of perception. Perception is a process where the individuals organize, analyze and interpret. So these individuals organize, analyze and interpret their sensory impressions in order to give meaning to their environment. So here each and every individual, each one of us will try to organize, analyze and interpret whatever the information we receive through our sense organs. Why we do this? Because we do this in order to give meaning to the environment. So whatever our sense organs receive, we try to organize those information and we try to analyze it and we try to interpret it. Whatever we see, whatever we hear, everything we try to organize, analyze and interpret. For example, you are listening to the video and when you are watching and listening to the video, you try to organize and you try to analyze and interpret whatever information I am giving. So each individual will organize all this to understand the environment or to give meaning to the environment. So perception in simple terms is how an individual organizes, analyzes and interprets the information to understand the situation and the environment. So to understand the situation and the environment in which we are living, to give a meaning to the environment, we will organize and analyze and interpret all the data or information we gather. We systematically organize it, we analyze it and interpret it. Now for example, if two people watch the movie, one might like the movie, one might not like the movie because how they analyze and interpret the movie, how they understand the movie, how they analyze each and every sequence that they see, how they relate it, how they organize the information that is available in the movie is totally different. Hence their perception is different. If an organization has to bring lot of change, then the first thing they have to do is change the perception of the employees. So how employees analyze, interpret the data should be changed. Next let us understand the process of perception. Perception has six steps in this process. The first one is stimuli. Stimuli talks about what kind of force what kind of object or what kind of reinforcement will trigger your response. Stimuli are those objects or situation or people which force you to react or respond. Maybe sight, sound, smell, taste and texture. So if a sound comes, you try to react to that. If a smell comes, you try to react to that. These stimuli will be receptive or will be taken by the sensory receptor. For example, sense organs. For example, it's a beautiful sunrise that is happening. There's a beautiful sight. And this beautiful sight will be received by the eyes. There's a beautiful music that you are listening. So that is a sound. The sound will be heard or listened by your ears. So like this, each stimuli will be received by the sense organs and these sense organs when they receive, it will have an attention towards those stimuli. So when you get a very beautiful music, all of a sudden you tend your attention towards that, you try to focus on that, you try to listen what is the music is all about and then you try to interpret and then you respond and then you behave according to that. So this is a process of perception. 
for example you are sitting in a boring lecture and when you are sitting in a boring lecture you like at the same time you like harley davidson bike and when you are sitting in a lecture outside on the road there a sound comes which you start thinking that it is harley davidson bike so the sound of the bike is harley davidson so as soon as the sound comes your sensory receptor that is your ear becomes active it receives that sound as soon as the sound comes your attention your focus will tend towards the bike or the sound of the bike then you start interpreting analyzation and interpretation where you try to check whether this sound is harley davidson sound or some other bike sound so you try to interpret and analyze that particular stimulate that particular sound then you respond then you come to a conclusion saying that whether it is harley davidson or not and finally you behave once you identify that it is harley davidson you try to peep from the window and see the bike because you are fond of harley davidson so this particular process happens very fast in human brain and human physiology but this is how it happens so each stimuli will be received by sensory receptors as soon as you receive the sensory receptor your attention will be tend towards that you interpret the data you respond and then you behave so behavior is always an outcome of all the factors so while discussing personality while discussing attitude we discussed behavior is an outcome even in perception behavior is an outcome so how you receive how you attend how you analyze how you interpret and how you respond make conclusions based on that you behave so this is how the perception or process of perception works thank you very much for watching the video